Differences in pupil size or reaction, while often benign, could also be a sign of a serious condition or even a life-threatening health issue. Examination by an IMD is required, especially if this is a new condition. A difference in pupil sizes is called anisocoria. As many as one in five people may have some normal variation between the sizes of their pupils without any other complications. This is called physiologic anisocoria, which doesn't affect your eyesight or the health of your eyes, so there's no need for treatment. If anisocoria is a symptom of an eye disorder, you will generally have other symptoms related to that disorder. These symptoms may include drooping of the eyelid, also called ptosis, reduced eye movement, eye pain, fever, headache, or reduced sweating. If you experience any of these symptoms with anisocoria, you should contact your ophthalmologist, your IMD, immediately. If you are having other symptoms along with anisocoria, your IMD will conduct other tests that are appropriate to the symptoms. Two eye disorders that anisocoria is commonly associated with are third nerve cranial nerve palsy and Horner syndrome. Both are disorders that can occur when nerves that travel to the eye are damaged by a stroke, tumor, or trauma. Other possible causes include viral infections, syphilis, damage as a result of surgery, or a neurological condition called Aedes tonic pupil. If your anisocoria is related to another eye disorder, treatment will depend on the cause. To learn more about eye health or to ask an IMD a question, visit getismart.org.